Hi everyone, it's Gina Mayo, and I'm so thrilled to have you as part of Music in Our Homeschool Plus. Today I'm going to walk you through the membership site so you can see everything you have access to. So if you go to musicinourhomeschool.com slash membership, memorize that, bookmark it so that you can get here really easily, you will log in and then you can get into the site through the, and you'll see the screen. So let me show you, it says course curriculum here. You know that you're in Music in Our Homeschool Plus, that's the membership site. And there are these big bolded uh, topics that you'll see here. So you've got introduction to membership, then you've got your monthly music activity lesson calendar, uh, live and exclusive monthly lessons. The next one is beginning music theory, then you've got active summer learning. I might move this one further to the bottom after summer's over. Community discussions, special fine arts topic master classes for high school. And then you've got your advanced music theory course for high school. So that takes you down to the bottom. Um, that is a very long course, 70 something lessons. Okay. I'm going to scroll right back up to the top here so we can talk about each section. So start here. That's where you will, you should start. And if you start here, you'll see that I want you to focus on just getting one 15 minute music lesson done a week. You can use your phone, tablet, computer, smart TV. You, yes, you could just use your phone and show the lessons right there to your kids sitting on the couch or at the kitchen table. And here's the monthly calendar. A lot of the members like to just use the calendar. So you could click on that and it'll take you to whatever the monthly calendar is. Here's another link you can memorize. This is what I usually do each day with my own kids music in our homeschool.com slash calendar and it will take you right here and um, you scroll down and you see the links for whatever the lesson is sometimes the videos right there if it's somebody's birthday or it'll say something like do some body percussion activities so you just click the link and it will take you to the lesson so this one Body Percussion Activities has a video lesson and an activity pack that goes with it. So let me go back and show you that, um, actually it was this page, right? In the start here. You also want to make sure you are signed up to get the monthly email, sorry, the weekly email, because I will also give you the links to those lessons in the email. So if you want to, you could just open up your email to play the lesson that you want each week, each day. Here's some other helpful information. And this, remember I said, is start here, how to use. Uh, the video tour of the membership, that is where I'm going to put this particular video. The welcome party will be on September 6th. And so you could click here to get the information to join the welcome party. I hope you'll join us. Um, FAQ, some frequently asked questions. Click there for those. Make sure you are figuring out where you are on the success path. I will click through this one. If you are a beginner, you're just getting it done. You're just starting to get used to adding music to your homeschool in this manner and doing one lesson a week. Then eventually you'll move into the advanced going and growing stage and you're getting more consistent and it's getting easier. And then you become a pro and you can't see yourself not including music in your homeschool. So that is your goal to get to pro. Here are some tips to be successful. I do have a refer a friend program so you can share the link with your friends and get some benefits that way. Every month I have a $25 giveaway. Um, it's a contest and what you wanna do is share your calendar. So let me just give you an example. So you print out the calendar and you just put check marks on the days that you did a lesson. Um, I include 
the pretty calendar of the month. There's a black and white version for less printing and there's a blank version. Maybe you're coming up with your own lessons. You don't like my plan, so you do your own thing. You could be going through a particular course like American Music for Elementary or Learn Classical Music with Cartoons. And so you just write down each day that you do a lesson what you did. You share it at the bottom, share a copy of a photo right there and you get a chance to win $25. Okay, you get a discount code for um, whether you want a course that is not part of the membership. Here is an easy link to find everything that you have access to. All of your preschool, elementary, and high school courses, just click this link and you can find those. There are some bonuses and some complimentary memberships, and I do include a certificate if you need to show that to um, an umbrella program or whatever you might need to have proof that you did your music. All right, so I, the next section, as I told you, is the music lesson calendar. So let's skip down to the live lesson schedule. So I'm going to be adding 2023 version after this, um, pretty soon, but these were the lessons that I taught this year or still going to teach. I just did the John Williams and his movie themes this week. Um, and you can join in live and watch the lesson and interact with me, or you can watch it after I will load the video in there and that will be fun too. All right, so let's see what else we have. Lots of videos here on all kinds of different music topics. So then we have beginning music theory. This is a course that is only part of the membership. Um, you can learn about notes of the treble and bass clef, cymbals, uh, rhythms, body percussion, sight singing with solfege, intervals, major minor chords, beginning music uh, theory with the piano keyboard, so uh, dynamics and tempo. So go through those. If you want your kids to get a basis of beginning music theory, you can go through those with them. And then here's some fun active lessons. If you feel like we've been sitting too much, let's get up off the couch, off of the desks and do something active. So singing games and bucket drumming hand clapping games. I love to interact with the members, so please list your questions and comments in this section. And then this last two parts are especially for your high schoolers who are working on getting a fine arts credit. I hired some master teachers in all kinds of different fine arts areas. You've got steps for preparing for a college degree in theater. You've got um, vocal anatomy and production. Um, you've got beginning guitar and ukulele, African dance, tap dance, watercolors, cartooning. So these are really fun. If you want, if your kids want to get a, a dabble in different fine arts areas, they can do that course. And then if you have a student that wants to be a music major in college, I highly recommend they go through this advanced music theory course before going to college because that music theory freshman year is a weed out class and can be very difficult for some students. So this will prepare them if they go through the advanced music theory course, which again is also only part of the membership. So if you have any questions, be sure to let me know and any tips or ideas for making the membership better, I would love to do that for you.